What's up guys, Sidian here, and welcome to the first episode of my playthrough for Lost. Or my playthrough of Lost with an kinda kinda screwed up. I'm gonna turn the volume down. A little bit there, but I want you guys to hear it. So this is a uh, like a survival horror kind of thing. You guys will see what it's like. Please leave a like if you enjoy the series because I, I, I want to see how much you guys are interested in other games. Because I really want to give my channel a little bit more diversity. So, prelude. The modern bedlam offers no cure for the ill and imprisoned and no respite saves, save for anonymity. An anonymity. Anonymity. I can't pronounce it pr properly. Maybe I did. I don't know. It always sounds wrong. Okay. I am really creep. I'm thoroughly creeped out. Okay, so it looks like we, it's like, uh, this is interesting. Why'd I go faster? I'm hmm? to administration. Over. So I'll use, okay, okay, so you can move it around like this and use one hand. Some kids may have snuck in. Taking a quick look. I don't think we should take a quick look, but whatever. So why did that turn green? Does that mean I'm running? Okay, that's like running or sprinting or whatevs. Okay, I wish the it's kind of I wish it were a little bit more responsive uh, for when I turn the camera angle around, because that could be an issue. Maybe I guess we'll see. All staff from Sir Ethan Weatherby. It's a great honor that announced promotion. Ah. Uh, mission at Weatherby is Asylum. Alleviate the suffering of our long-term residents. Advance our understanding of mental illness through pioneering research. Okay. You'll all work hard to return Weatherby to the forefront of healthcare innovation. I don't know what that means. I, I, don't, I don't know what that means, but... So we're going to administration. That's the greenhouse. We're not going there. What's this? That's all locked up and stuff, so it's not that. Oh, it looks like we're going to be going down here. Huh. I am thoroughly creeped out. So if you want to know why I decided to do this series, um, I don't know, like, let's be honest. Did it just close? No. Horror games are... No, please stop. Don't. Mob crush. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh, it's Mob Crush, my streaming thing. Um, the graphics are fantastic. So, okay, so it looks like I'll use this. Okay, I got, I got, I got what I'm doing now. We're here in New England, the inf infamous Weatherby Asylum. The story from this place are legendary, not just because the creepy Weatherby Megacorp got started here. I've attached some articles to this journal. We should make a good haul of creepy old journals and files. Okay. So, a million copies make a talk show circuit. Ha, huh, right? Huh. Hmm. You don't think that's the best idea? So, it looks like we'll be going this way. So, it looks like... Okay. This is weird. This is very, uh, interesting controls. It's the madman's madhouse. Okay. Sorry, I'm just screwing around. Hmm. Yeah. I don't know who he is, but... Whoa, what is this crap? Isolation ward? What the frick, man? Okay, the largest asylum ever operated in the United States. Wow, haunted by unexplained deaths. The asylum was shut down in 1945. Looks like it was reopened. Grew rapidly. Built a, the ho built a house up to 10,000 patients. Wowzers. Sorry, I'm just 
briefly scanning through. You can pause if you really want to read all of it. But we'll spend forever. <laughs> so where are we going here? Any doors that I missed? Anyth oh, it's probably over here. I'm stupid. Yeah. Yeah. Can't say I want to open it, but... I know, kid. There's a paper over here, so we might as well grab it. Um, noti notorious psychiatrist Dr. Elijah Primrose let presided over a special wing where patients were allegedly utilized for behavioral research. It's rumored that the patients may have died. Whoa. Whoa. Com Licklo. The infamous Wicker Man was a resident of Weatherby's maximum security wing. This killer arsonist terrorized the East Coast for years, including burning a family of six alive. Holy balls, man. That's... What is this? Stuff? A rag. So we just... Did I take it? I think I took it. I think I took it. What? I don't want to go down there, man. I can tell you that, holy... I don't know. It's a brave freaking little kid. I don't know about you. I wouldn't say he's merchant. I'd be like, oh man, please, people. I'll penalize your face. Have. What if I don't want to come out? Man. Gosh dang it, this is creepy as frick. Where are we supposed- Whoa! You need a slow clap, bro. It sucks to be rotten luck, that's what I get for ignoring procedure. Falling through a floor. I tried to rescue the kid solo and fell right through the rotten floor. I hope nothing's broken. I wouldn't rescue this place solo. And again, I'm a baby, so- Ruin Raiders forever. There's a lot of checkpoints on the bright side, so... That's unfortunate. That's really unfortunate. That means you can't shoot the monsters, which I don't know if that would work anyway, but... Oh, thank you, destroy a craft. Sorry. I don't have... My notifications are on, so... Staff room. Hmm. What? What is that? No, is this what I think it is? <sighs> if you don't know what that means, that means we're gonna have to hide. Which is extremely unpleasant. Is this open? Yup, we can go in here. You can open it, man. Okay! Great. Is well, is one. Key can be used to unlock doors. Oh great, it's unlocked. It's not like I hear stuff or anything from here. What? No! No, 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 no. Oh, 
No. Oh my god. I'm... Nope. The freak was that? I want to go out now. What? Oh. This is absolutely great. Oh, we have to click this. This shows your current inventory. Okay. Select items you picked up to learn more about it. Useful information about the... Draw an X and get the hint. Okay. Goal. Find another way out of the asylum. Okay. Please stop. Please stop, little kid. You're kind of freaking the freak out of me. You'll remember that device is off limits to general staff, except to express written permission to Dr. Primrose or myself. Uh, okay. This is so freaking creepy, Jesus. Jesus, man. Jesus, man. Just waiting for a jump scare. I feel like it's gonna happen. You continue, there is no going back. We're gonna end it off here. Anyway, thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed the series. Definitely leave a like if you want to see more. And I'm really scared, so anyway. <laughs> oh man. Next episode, we'll be going through that door and seeing what freaky crap we have to deal with. So, yes, Sidian. Out.